Welcome to the San Diego Zoo. I'm Yadira Galindo at the Giant Panda Research Station. I'm going to tell you how you can help us name our newborn giant panda cub. But first, let's check in with Dr. Meg Sutherland-Smith to get an update on this week's panda cub physical exam. Today's exam uh, was uh, shorter than the previous exams because the cub was very, very vocal. It's the most vocal I've seen the cub. Um, from the time we bought the cub out of the den and had it on our exam table, it was vocalizing the whole time. I had a hard time listening to the heart and lungs because it was so vocal. She can actually see that she's not where she usually is, which is which is just totally different than the floor of the den. You know, she's on you know a towel area that she can see and know that hey, this this isn't this isn't normal. This isn't right. My mom, you know, my mom's not here. So it's sort of a a, a natural response to then vocalize to say, hey mom, hey mom, come get me. I'm not in the right place. And and Bayoun was responding and saying, I am. Well, I'm trying. I'm trying. And she came right in and then just attended to the cub. She's definitely seeing everything. Now. Yeah, she is seeing everything. She's yeah. like, hey, this is different. <laughs> this is not my home. In 1999, China named the first cub born at the San Diego Zoo Wamei, or China, USA. The zoo's panda team named Mei Sheng, whose name means born in the USA, in 2003. While in 2005, we asked for your help in naming Su Lin. Her name means a little bit of something very cute. In appreciation for the community's continued support of the Giant Panda Conservation Program, the San Diego Zoo is asking its visitors to suggest the name for the newborn female giant panda cub. The name should be in Chinese, having significant meaning, and must be delivered in person to the Giant Panda Research Station between October 5th and October 14th. After the 10-day period, the zoo's giant panda team will choose several names from those suggested and send them to the Chinese Wildlife Conservation Association for their blessing. Don't worry, those of you who just can't make it will have a chance to vote through the zoo's website at sandiegozoo.org for the final name. So check back later this month to vote. Stay tuned to sandiegozoo.org for more information. Remember, you belong in the zoo, the San Diego Zoo.